Once upon a time, there was a poor old couple. The old man was almost ready to leave to go to the fields. He just needed his delicious lunch prepared by his wife. With that in hand, he went to the fields. Once there, he put his lunch inside the hollow of a tree and began to work the fields, picking out weeds. While he was working, some monkeys walked by and noticed his lunch in the tree. The man looked on in surprise. In all of his many years of work, he had never seen any monkeys in this area. The monkeys slowly creep towards the man's lunch and then quickly grabbed it and gobbled down all of his food. The man sat down and watched the monkeys. He found them interesting and didn't mind giving them his lunch. After the monkeys had finished the food, they looked towards the old man and walked over towards him. The old man was nervous when the monkeys moved his direction. Would they attack him? He decided to sit perfectly still so he didn't accidentally anger them. When the monkeys got close, one of them shouted out, It's a Jizo statue! Sure enough, the old man did look surprisingly like the monks depicted on Jizo statues. I have an idea, one of the monkeys said. If we take him to a shrine and treat him well, we will surely be blessed with good fortune. The group of monkeys agreed, so they picked up the old man and started off towards their shrine. On their way, they began to sing a very silly song to pass the time. The song was so funny that the old man almost burst out laughing, but he was able to contain it. Finally, the monkeys reached the shrine and said a prayer. Then they gave him an offering of gold coins and left. The old man couldn't believe his luck. He was now rich. He went into town before returning home. He bought tons of food and a new kimono for his wife. Suddenly, the old couple's nosy neighbor came through the door, demanding to know why the couple sounded so happy. The old man told her the story of what happened, and she was amazed. The next day, she told her husband what happened, and they decided to try and get rich from those monkeys as well. The husband went out to the field, put his lunch in the hollow of a tree, just like the old man had done, and then, instead of working the field, sat excitedly, waiting for the monkeys. Eventually, the monkeys did come and once again ate the food. They saw the husband and thought he was also a Jizo statue, so they decided to bring him to their shrine as well. Just like before, while traveling, the monkeys sang their silly song. The husband tried his best not to laugh, but he just couldn't resist. The monkeys were shocked to realize that they were carrying a person and not a statue. They dropped him in the water and ran away. Now, instead of becoming incredibly rich, the husband became incredibly wet. Meanwhile, the neighbor was so excited to buy new fancy clothes with the money her husband would bring, that she decided to start a fire and burn all of their old clothes. Little did she know, that her husband was on his way back home, crying at the thought of how angry his wife would be when he told her that they would not live happily ever after.